Hi, and welcome to Let's Play Pandemic. It's a board game. I'm your host, Flip. Uh, here with me are these three guys. Hey, I'm Prime, or Chris, as you're probably going to hear me called. I am Exploding Knees, or Logan. Uh, yeah. Hi, my name is John Nicholson, and I'm also <laughs> referred to as Dr. No More Thorax. Dr. No More Thorax. No more Thorax. <laughs> no one at all. <laughs> The worst ant doctor ever. Um, <laughs> so we're going to be playing Pandemic, which is a board game, as you can tell. Um, hopefully. If you can't, then I think you're watching the wrong video. Um, I guess I'll explain how to play the game, because two of our players here do not know how to play the game either. Yep. Uh, so the way you play the game is that on your turn... Uh, first of all, the goal of the game is to get rid of all these diseases and get all, the, all four cures. If you get all four cures, you win. It sounds pretty easy. Um, on your turn, you'll take four actions, unless you have something that says otherwise, which we have. Um, and if you go ahead and if you guys click on the action key on the top, it'll bring mm. up these like two cards, All right. which tells you the different actions you can take. Uh, there's the basic actions and the special actions, but I'll just refer to them as actions because they're no different than anything else. Um, so the first thing you can do is drive, which means you move from one area to another area that is connected with a red line. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, it does. Yarp. Then you have direct flight, where you can get rid of a card from your hand. For instance, I have the Buenos Aires card, so I can travel from Atlanta, where I'm at, to Buenos Aires by discarding the Buenos Aires card. And that takes oh. one action. If, let's say I was in Buenos Aires, wherever that is, down there, it's and I had the there. Buenos Aires card, which I do, I can discard it to fly anywhere else in the world for one action. Oh, so if you wait, so if you're, if you have, if you have the card of the city yeah. you're in, you can discard it to fly anywhere. Okay. Now, do they have a bug problem in Buenos Aires? Because I've I've heard they have bug problems and meteorite problems. I don't know. I don't see any diseases there, so obviously they're clean right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Um. The other kind of flight is the shuttle flight, where you can fly from one research station to another research station. If you look at Atlanta, you'll notice this little, like, plus red sign of healthy thing. That's the research station. Um, we can place out research stations with another action. I'll talk about that in a minute. Um, so let's say I, I just put a research station in Istanbul. So let's say I wanted to go from Atlanta to Istanbul. That would take one action because they are connected by research stations. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. does. Yep. Okay. Um, so now we get to the special actions. I don't know what's so special about them, but um, to build a research center, which is the thing I just showed you about, uh, you have to be in a city, you have to have the card for that city, and then you discard that card, and you build a research station. Hmm. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah, that makes mm -hmm. sense. Okay. Um, to discover a cure, which is very important because we'll be doing this to you know, win the game, we have to do it four times. So that's not going to be very much used action, but it's very important. You have to discard five cards of the same color. And then you also have to be in a research station. And then you cure that disease. Uh, okay? Okay. Another important thing is treat disease. You'll be doing this a lot, which is if you're in an area that has cubes, which represent disease, you can remove a single cube for one action. Okay? Mm -hmm. A single cube for one action? Yes. Uh. How many, how many special actions can you do a turn? Only you, one? You can do four actions a turn. It doesn't matter what kind of actions. That's why I said I don't know oh. why they put it as special actions. It's kind oh, of, okay, okay, okay. It's kind so of you silly. can... Okay, okay, I see, okay. Okay, and now the one that everybody gets confused about, which is share knowledge. Um, so let's say I have the New York card, and I'm in New York, and I want to give you the New York card, and you're in New York, I can do that. Mm. Okay, as an action. Let's say I want to give you the New York card and you're in Washington, and I'm in Washington. I can't do that because it's not the Washington card that I'm trying to give you. Okay. Does that make sense? So to give, a, to give someone else a card as an action, you have to um, both be in the same place, and that place has to be the card that you're, you're passing over. Okay. Okay? Everyone gets uh, confused about that. It's the yeah. hardest action in the game. Definitely. Okay. So after you take your four actions... You will draw two cards from the player deck, which is the one that has cards left 52 over it. It's the one with like the medic symbol on the bottom of the screen. Yes. So you'll draw two cards. Uh, most of the cards are city cards, which are like Chicago or 
Ho Chi Minh City or whatever. Uh, but there's four cards in there that are Epidemic cards. And when we hit the first one, I'll tell you about it. Epidemics are bad. They're the worst card ever. I hate them. Actually, yeah. the first time we played this, uh, the, the first, first card was The very was first card was an Epidemic, <laughs> and it was terrible. Ah, challenge accepted. <laughs> Okay, so you'll draw your two cards, you'll put them into your hand, and then if you have more than seven cards, you have to discard down to seven cards. Okay. Uh, uh, the final thing you do on your turn is you draw infection cards, which is like the bad thing that you do, um, depending on what the infection rate is. Right now the infection rate is at two, so you'll draw two cards from the top of the infection deck. Uh, oh, yeah. We'll put one cube on each of those, and then it'll go to the next player's turn. If ever we run out of cubes of a single color on the side of the board, so like if we run out of blue cubes on the side, right now there's 21. If it's ever at zero, yeah. we lose the game. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, shoot. Okay. If you ever get eight outbreaks, and what an outbreak is, is if you would place a cube in a place that has three cubes already in it, because three is the max, there's no more people that can be diseased there, so instead everybody flees that city, and there's an outbreak. So every city that is attached to that city will get a cube, and the outbreak counter will move one forward. If there's ever eight mm -hmm. outbreaks, we lose the game. Okay. Uh, also, if we ever run out of cards in the player deck, we lose the game. It's very like, easy uh, to lose this game. It's very easy to lose this game. <laughs> it's mm -hmm. very. It's it's a pretty difficult game. I have like a 50-50 win rate on easy mode, and after that, it just gets worse. Yeah. Um, there's a hard mode. <clears throat> yes. And then there's oh, man. super hard mode. We're on, like, normal mode. <laughs> <laughs> it's not as bad as Ghost Stories. In Ghost Stories, they have, like, the level... They have, like, initiate level, like, medium, hard, and hell. But yeah. initiate level might as well be called impossible, because it's impossible. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like Red November, man. Mm. I've won yeah. Red November, though. Anyways, um, so we each have a special ability to help us fight the infections. I am the containment specialist. Whenever I enter a city that has two or more cubes of the same color, I get to remove one of those cubes for free. Um, awesome. Player two, prime, Chris, whatever. Uh, I'm player four, actually. Oh, you're player four? Who's player two? Yes. I think that might be me. That's you, Logan. Oh, well, yeah. okay then. You're the troubleshooter? Uh, I am the troubleshooter. Uh, on my turn start, I can peek at... The number of cards on top of the infection draw pile equal to the current infection rate. So I'll be able to look at those and be like, oh, something bad's going to happen and it's going to be John's fault because it's coming up in two turns. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, <laughs> well, they'll, they'll be the ones that you, you're going to pull that turn. So you'll know, like, if, like, if the card is Lagos, you'll know, oh, God, I got to get there and fix it. Yeah. And then, um, when performing a direct flight action, you reveal, but do not discard the card. So you can fly all over the place. Mm -hmm. That's pretty sweet. Okay, player three is the scientist. Um, uh, uh, okay, so I'm the scientist, uh, John. And, and for the scientist's ability, you need only four cards of the same color to d discover a cure. Oh, is, that's nice. great. Which is nice. really I'll be able to Save everyone. Hopefully. <laughs> and player four, four is the generalist. Yes, the generalist. I get to spend five actions instead of four each turn. Ooh. Yes, that's very helpful. Yeah, he'll be on the move. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're obviously on speed. You're just running around. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm not above taking the red eye to get out to you know Madrid or whatever. <laughs> Isn't that a drug from Cowboy Bebop? Like... <laughs> um, okay. So, who wants to go first? Do you, do you guys care? I'll go first. Or, okay, John's going oh, first. Okay. <laughs> That's fine, then. I guess we'll just go in a normal order, though. So, after John, the uh, flip, then me, then Chris, then John, then flip. Okay. Hi, right, so, I'll start this. I take four actions, right? Okay. Yeah, you do four actions. Okay, so, let's see. Um, so I am going to move to Chicago okay. by using dr the basic action drive. So okay. I'm going to move to Chicago. And then I'm going to, uh, treat the diseases. So I'll take, I'll use two of, of my actions to take the, uh, sh both Chicago cubes out. Is that, am I able to do that? Yeah. yeah. So okay. that's three actions. 
And you, yeah, you just move them onto the pile. And then, uh, let's see. So you still have one more action. I have one more action. Let's see. Go to San Francisco. Cure the, uh, the gaids. Mm. The gaids. <laughs> the gaids. Gaids. <laughs> okay, I know. Uh, then I'm going to take a, uh, I'm going to discard my car, my Shanghai card to move to that city. Oh, there we go. All right, fly to Shanghai. John's okay. booking it across the map. And the, discard, oh. the discard's right next to the draw pile. That, I, I discarded it. Right there, there was one thing I was gonna say that I remember from last game. Um, what? There's only one. Oh yeah, there's only one card, card of each city. <clears throat> so we what? only remember, have so many red cards, so many black cards, so many blue cards, etc. Okay. For every city, there's only one card for it. So I think we can only discard up to like four or five of a color before we can't win the game. Do it anymore. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So just keep that in mind. So don't fly, drive. Okay. So now you're gonna draw your two cards. I'm gonna draw, go ahead and drag them onto the board. So. People at home can see. Uh, no! Oh. Go, John. <laughs> yeah! Bring it on. Okay. <laughs> Challenge accepted. <laughs> so drag, go ahead and drag Kinshasa into your hand. Ah, uh, thank you. Okay. So now an epidemic. Epidemics are bad. The first thing we do in an epidemic is we increase the infection rate. So now instead of two cards, there's two cards each turn. Oh my god. Thanks, John. <laughs> oh my god. Then we infect a brand new city, so we'll draw a card from the bottom of the infection deck. So London suddenly got super AIDS and is boned. <laughs> oh, London! Okay. Oh. We then put London into the discard pile, and then we intensify. And what intensify means is we shuffle the infection discard pile and put it back on top of the infection yep. deck. And that was an epidemic. And it might not oh. seem that terrible, but now every single place that's been infected mm -hmm. is going to get infected again within the next however many turns. So it's yep. bad. And then I have to draw an infection card, right? Right, which is the one on where it says infection deck. Just draw two, so Lagos. Lagos gets one. Where's Lagos? And Cario. Ky Cairo. I'll get Cario? Cario? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Cairo. I got a hit Cairo. Okay. Did you put one on Lagos, or does Lagos have three on it? Oh, Lagos has three on it. Okay, so now an outbreak occurs. So one goes to San Paolo, to Kinshasa, and to oh, Khartoum. No, no, no. Not to Johannesburg. What the hell are you doing? Shh, I don't like him down there. <laughs> okay. What about Sao Paulo? Doesn't Sao Paulo get one Yes, it does. I, I put one there, but he dragged it on to Johannesburg. And now they, we have one outbreak towards losing the game. Oh, man. I know. Great. It, it begins. Let's do this, guys. It works together. Okay, so is it my turn now? It is. Yeah. It is. What do I have in my hand? I have Buenos Aires and Miami. Uh, where's Buenos? There it is. One, two... It's in Southern America. Three. Um, that's not that helpful. <laughs> I can walk... Oh, I can walk up to London and, and cure one off that, I think. One, two, yeah. I, Don't you get I two because up. of your ability? Yeah. So or I go one, one for free. two, three. That one's free. And then... Uh, do I want to cure another one? Yeah, I'll cure another one. Return. Return. Then I draw two cards. I got mobile hospital. I can remove one cube from every city he drives. Oh, that's cool. Oh, so in type oh, a. so as as long as you travel through them, you can just clear the one of them out. Yeah, that's a, that's on that's for one turn on only turn. though. During, the, during this turn, and I can well, I, I can use it on anybody. It's just um oh, it, it like it's a card that I can save for later. Mm. I might be best to use on Chris, because he could just mob it through a bunch of places. Yeah, he could go to Beijing, Seoul, or wait, no, where is, I don't know. Anyways, London gets hit. Ah, good thing I went to London. And Seoul. No! Oh, no. Outbreak again. Outbreak. So there's one in Beijing, which is bad. And, and then Shanghai. Shanghai. Yeah. It's a good thing you're over there. Yeah, no, too, too bad your turn's already over. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's just going to get worse. <laughs> okay, so player player two, it's your turn. That's me. Ooh. So at the beginning of my turn, I get to look at the top two infection cards in the infection deck. Yeah, you can just reveal them because it's like. So just drag them. Drag them onto the board. Okay, there's a first one. It's not like you wouldn't tell us what it is. There's a second one. Karachi. Oh wait, where's Madrid? Okay, it's only got one. Yeah. And yes. Karachi. It has one and two. Karachi has okay, one. Only has one. Yeah. All right then. So then you just put them back on top. Or you can leave them on the side, I guess. If I'll leave know. them there for now, because they're going to get pulled off anyway. Okay. Okay, so... I'll move to Washington for one turn, New York for another turn, Madrid for a third turn, and I will take that one cube off of Madrid, That even though it's about to get hit again, but that's pretty much all I can do this turn. 
Okay, so draw your two cards. Let's see, we got uh, Tehran and Osaka. Okay. Which doesn't help you at all towards getting a cure. Shh, they're mine. <laughs> I own them. <laughs> okay, and then one cube goes on Madrid, and one cube goes on Karachi, if you want to get that. I don't know where Karachi is. I don't, I don't pay attention to the, the to the black... There it right. is. I found it. Uh, Karachi. It. Oh, okay. Yeah, Karachi has two. Okay. And player player three. Well, technically it would go to me now, because John is technically player three. Ah, Chris, you're up. <laughs> yeah. Okay, ne next. <laughs> All right, let's see here. I've got five moves. Uh, let's see here. 